Hi you guys, welcome back to the vlog and today I am going to show you guys how we get ready for a birthday since we simplified our life. Max had a wish, he wanted to have a shelf above his bed so I am going to put up the shelf. <laughs> My husband always like to do these things because he is positive that I put way too many holes on the wall, which I can see that he is right. Sometimes I can't find the start for the first time, so it can happen. Okay guys, so we have to tidy up a little here okay. because you want to shop up there, right? Yes. Okay, go up there and please show me where do you want that shop? Over here. Okay, are you sure you're not going to clunk your head there? Yes. Okay, so I am kind of hoping not to ruin the wall. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. I can do it. <laughs> you know that goes on that thingy, on the thing? Can you, can you bring that, that part? <laughs> Oh, and you can ask your 12 years old what to do. Oh, thank you. So, what do you do? Oh. Okay, that's not gonna work. Okay, I'm not sure if that's something I can work with. Okay, there's gotta be something for that. I'm not sure if I can do this with hand. Oh my god. Okay, I'm getting some bit. Okay, so the tricky way to find a stud is to knocking on it and it has a different, it makes a different noise when I knock on the area where the studs are. However, this is an older house and the studs are kind of separated from the drywall, so not always accurate. So let's see how many holes I have to put in there. <laughs> What you got there? Ooh, that's a fine selection. Yeah. Are you happy? Yes. Do you like your shop? Yes. Max's favorite is sushi, so we are trying to come up with a sushi themed party decor. Ok 
Okay, so these are almost done. I think they look pretty cool. These are the ones that are done. And I'm just getting on the roll, guys. So we are gonna go to visit some friends. We're gonna be over for a dinner. And what I like to do for my boys, just in case if there are foods that we cannot eat, we always have a backup. That is sweet. And I wanted to show you guys this one. So this is an amazing thing because it has only dates, organic dates, organic sunflower seeds and raisins and cocoa powder, apricots sesame seeds goji powder so basically it has no sugar in there it's sweetened with raisins and dates this is an other favorite and it only has three ingredients so it's only had chocolate and honey and peppermint oil nothing else in there and i have to tell you this is amazing so i'm just going to put one of that on the middle and we are ready to go good morning you guys this is it. Today is a birthday day. Max is up. I already sang him the happy birthday, which I don't know if it's a gift or a punishment for him. <laughs> I'm trying my best, but my singing skills just, let's just say it's missing some keys, but he seemed very happy. So the rest of the boys are still in bed and sleeping. So I went to Trader Joe's because my little one likes flower and specifically he likes sunflower so i was able to find some sunflowers and also i find this cute flower so i'm going to put this for him on the shelf that i recently put it up for now the boys are going to speak with their grandma on skype and then i'm going to start to make the cakes yes cakes i'm going to make well i'm going to make some cupcake and i'm going to make a very unique cake i've been doing this for the last couple of years a few years ago i ran across on the internet with this cake that it doesn't need any baking so that cake is very special because my little one maxi he is obsessed with fruit so that cake will be just only made from fruit and it's gonna be a very tall one and then for today we went to visit friends yesterday we had an awesome time we they have a pool table so we played and laughed a lot so that was an amazing time that was a perfect warm-up for the birthday but today uh, we don't really planning a big birthday party we usually we always do a birthday party like last year literally like a few days before we moved we had a birthday party but this year we're just gonna do a very simple um bowling we're gonna go to bowling that was his wish so that's what we're going to do to water are the eucalyptus that I've got and also those pink flowers are smell so good it smells like spring and I just can't help but once in a while I have to buy this at Reader Joy's because of the smell of this flower so the actual day when we celebrated the birthday that's when we had a cloudy day so i thought just bringing in two more light to our home will have with a festive mood and we just use the christmas string lights so that way we can recycle and upcycle our things so we don't have to purchase other things to celebrate the birthday we can just reuse what we have and i have to tell you the boys were so happy for this decoration and at night before they went to the bed, it had a, such a nice soft color in our home.
So this is how I wrapped his presents. So first I had this too and we had an additional little thing to add to that and I was thinking how should I wrap that so I grabbed one of our napkin <laughs> this is a reusable napkin that we use in the kitchen and I just I just gathered around the fabric and I just tied it and it's I think it looks all teamed up and looks put together so this is what we like to do just keep reusing the bags we use this at christmas as well i think the pattern we can get away with all kinds of occasion i can just change the ribbon so we save those two so we can adjust to the occasion that we have So I have this amazing recipe that cupcakes are only made from eggs and beans and cocoa powder and if you want to see that video I will link it down below for you guys but this is the recipe that I usually like to put into a big pan but because it was a birthday I just put it in the cupcake shapes and for next I'm starting to prepare the cake the fruit cake and it was a little bit tricky to cut it but finally i i just really cut through everything that i needed to to get the shape that i wanted to have and it was really fun once you have those shapes cut and out it's really fun to put that together So I'm just securing the layers with this little stick sticks and they work very well to hold the whole thing together and this is the fun part this is when I get to decorate the cake and to me that's my favorite part I can get creative with all the fruits you can't go wrong with fruits they all look good taste good and my little one was really happy with the result I couldn't find any candles, but we're going to use that instead. 